Here's some quick tips on how to produce optimal images in patients who have breast implants. Breast implants can take what otherwise would be an excellent quality study and turn it into a limited at best. This is because implants prevent adequate ultrasound penetration similar to that of air in the lungs. Firstly, you want to adjust your ultrasound settings from pen to H-pen. The H stands for harmonics, while the pen stands for penetration. So this will provide high quality imaging by narrowing your beam and providing higher quality images in deep tissue. If your patient permits it, rotate them so that the front side is at a 45 degree angle with the scanning table. You'll want to obtain your parasternal views in a modified fashion. This is by placing your transducer a little bit more medially, just below the left breast while fanning up. Since your patient's in an overly rotated position, this will give your ultrasound beam an advantage of getting through the breast tissue by placing your transducer more laterally underneath the patient. Also, utilize your patient's respiration every time you take an image. So have your patient breathe in until your image quality improves or have them blow all their air out. Make good use of your subcostal views because none of the ultrasound beam will be going through the breast tissue. Sometimes you can get all of your parasternal views in your subcostal views simply by tweaking and twisting your transducer. Lastly, the obvious option is using a blood enhancing agent like Optison, Lumison, or Definity as long as the patient permits it. I'm Jim with UltrasoundBoardReview.com. Thanks for watching our quick ultrasound tips of the day.